Apple, Getty, Android smartphones can now send iPhone iMessages. Here's how to send to Apple's chat app. iMessage is a closed messaging system meant solely for Apple products, iPhones, Macs, Apple S and iPads. The clever system allows users to send messages between Apple products for free. Iconic blue text bubbles allow Apple users to send end-to-end encrypted text, GIFs, images and stickers instantly. Messages to and from Android users, or if you are not connected to the Internet or have data, will appear as green bubbles. You can even put together a group chat, and up until now Android users could not join the party. The new app where message works surprisingly well with Android phones, and will allow green bubble users to join their friends. The Google Play Store is to the brim with apps claiming to allow Android users to send iMessages. Unfortunately, many of these are fake apps designed to get a hold of your details. Other apps exploits in the coding iMessages use, which Apple is not too happy about. From Facebook to WhatsApp, these apps are the worst for eating through your monthly data allowance. This means the apps are usually shut down relatively fast. Where message relies on a different method to link you to the iMessage network, having an Apple Mac. The brilliant invention was created by 16-year-old developer Roman Scott. The genius created the app because he recognized a need for Android users to be able to iMessage. He explained, where message was created to serve the many Android users who are left out of the iMessage ecosystem, it allows you to access and take advantage of many great iMessage features. WEMESSAGE WEMESSAGE You can download the app on your Android smartphone where message can handle group chats, images, videos, animation effects and you can even enable read receipts. The secure app is also encrypted, so you don't need to worry about your private conversations being leaked. The app will start from scratch, and will not transfer your old iMessages from your Mac. The clever system will set up a server, called Wii Server, on your Mac to send and receive via iMessage, which are forwarded to your Android. Wii Server is described as a bridge between a Mac and an Android device. YouTube Android, the messaging service was created to bridge the gap between Mac and Android. Roman said, the reason why an Apple computer is needed is because the iMessages need to be sent through an Apple device in order to be delivered. Although the app works fine for now, it is thought the app may be closed down by Apple eventually. For now it is available to download for free through the Web Message website. You will first need to download Wii Server on your Mac. For this you will also need to install a Java. Before you go any further you will be to customize your system preferences to give the software terminal rights. To do this, go to System Preferences, Security. When you are at this point you should click the lock icon and enter your password. Then, press the sign and locate your terminal app, then select Open. You will then be free to load up the zip file and double click the run.command file. The app will then ask you for the email address you have associated with your iMessage account. Getty Messaging Service, you can join the Blue Bubble Gang after this, you will be prompted for a password to use with the Wii server. Once this is all done, you can install Wear Message on your smartphone through the Google Play Store. You will be asked for the Mac's IP address, along with the email address and password you have created. Your contacts should already be loaded onto the app, and you can start texting. If you still think it is a bit too complicated, the Wear Message website offers a helpful how-to guide. Related articles